Yeah. Cool. Yeah, the receivers did what we, we, we expected them to do. I mean, they uh, they took advantage of some individual matchups, and uh, I thought they came in some key key times in the games after Texas Tech had scored. So uh, I, I was pleased with the way Jordan and the receivers executed. Did you see that kind of a performance from Scotty coming in, in his first game? You know, you can never predict how they, how they go. I think uh, what we saw in the spring and what we saw in August camp, I, I think we suspected that he has some explosive talent, and, and he does, and he showed that today, and, and hopefully that continues as the season goes on. How can y'all get better there in the run game? Phil, Matt talked a little bit about wanting to be more efficient. What, what did you see? Well, like our passing game, we had some explosive runs. Uh, I think uh, every down when we don't have an explosive run, we still want our four or five. Um, I don't know where we were in the run game. Uh, I know certain plays were clicking for us in certain plays. Texas Tech was doing a good job defending, so. You know, we'll look at the film and make some decisions about our run game and take it there. With those explosive runs, what is Scotty doing to get free and create those? Well, you know, the one thing Scotty has, he has two things. One, he's very, very decisive. He's a lot like Jordan Tommy. Very decisive when he runs the football. Um, and he has a fifth gear. And so if he, if he, he can run over you, um, he can slash if he needs to, but he has a fifth gear. And he can take it to the house when he needs to or when they give him a crease, and he did that today. How do you feel uh, Jordan? Ran things today. Was he as efficient as you'd like him to be? He, he was. He had a couple uh, couple mentals in the red zone that he knew about. He, he he tells me about his mistakes before I get to him. That's it wasn't it wasn't even something that he did bad. It's just maybe he, you know he missed a curl route on a play. Um, he could have thrown one away. He did it. But o over the uh, course of 60 plays, I think I'm pretty happy without looking at the film with his execution. What, what did you think were some of the other breakdowns in the red zone where you guys had to settle for field goals? Well, we, we did. We missed a curl route. Um, we had an opportunity to get a first down. We had, we had somebody penetrate on a run play. Uh, we got pressured one time, didn't get the first down. So red, red zone-wise, you just don't want to kick that many field goals. I'm just not used to kicking that many field goals. And I think uh, as we continue to do this and get better, I think I think we'll get better in the red zone. Thank you. 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 Thank you.